In this video, I'm going to show you some actual Nintendo Labo VR gameplay from the Blaster Accessory. And all of this goodness is coming up. Hi and welcome to MRTV, my name is Sebastian Ang and this is your first time here and if you're just as excited about VR and AR as me, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. What you see here is actual Nintendo Labo VR gameplay from the Blaster Accessory and well, you can get this Blaster Accessory in the VR basic set for $40 together with the Nintendo Labo VR headset. So. I recorded this gameplay for my actual review of the VR basic set but well I thought why don't I just show you the gameplay first so that you can prepare for my full review which is coming up. So this is the gameplay of the main game for the blaster accessory. It's an unreal shooter as you can tell and it is actually really really good. Lots of fun. But let's talk about the blaster first. It was, first of all, it was just so much fun to build this thing. It took me like two to three hours and I truly, truly enjoyed that time. And I can tell you, it is not so hard. There are exact instructions, so you simply follow them step by step and you will build your own blaster and you will build your own VR headset and that itself is already pretty cool. So for the blaster itself and this game, you can interact with the game in different kind of ways. First of all, you have to reload. So you see that I'm reloading with my left hand and I can shoot with my right thumb. And also there's another thing, I can put down the visor and I can stop the time, which is pretty cool and I'm going to show you that later. First of all, what you can see here, I can first mark my enemies by simply using my, my the thumb trigger without having the gun cocked and then if I shoot the rocket will fly out and, and, and automatically fly into my enemy that I marked before so this is cool or if I don't mark an enemy before I would simply have to aim myself and simply shoot and of course this also works fine. And one thing which is also really cool about this accessory itself, when you reload the gun, you actually cock a rubber band. And then when you press on the trigger, this thing inside, which is held by the rubber band, will shoot forwards and you do have some kind of feedback, some force feedback. You can really tell that you're shooting, it's so cool. And now look at the gameplay itself. Here is one of the end bosses and actually, the production value is truly cool it's fun to play this and the 3d effect everything is totally fine and holding this in your hand and looking through it the immersion is great and the game itself is lots of fun as you can tell by the production values and everything comes together in a very very nice way here with the blaster so as you could tell just now i was marking the eyes of this crab and then I would just shoot the missile and the missile would simply fly into, into the eyes, into, into the target. So I have to now shoot at the knees and then I should defeat this enemy rather quickly. So we're very well done, lots of fun and it doesn't look actually as bad. Now what I'm doing here, I've put on the visor and I've stopped time and I can shoot several missiles at the same time and yeah, very soon I should defeat this enemy. I'm so looking forward to give you the full review of the Nintendo Labo VR Basic Kit for $40. If you want to get this, the link is down in the description below. And make sure to wait for my full review of the Nintendo Labo VR set. I'm going to review every single accessory and well, I'm actually looking forward to do that. As you could tell, I've defeated the end boss and that's it for this gameplay video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and that you have a bit more understanding of Nintendo Labo now. If yes, give it a thumbs up and of course, if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV yet, do so now and I'm looking forward to see you in the next video.